G'day, it's Pete here and we're back again for another FunBridge tournament. To get in, what you want to do is go uh, log into FunBridge, then get started exclusive tournaments. And you want to click view all tournaments and then search for BridgeVid or Pete Hollands. And taking out the top spot is Fuzzy Logic plus 36. In equal second spot is Lionheart 3 No Trumps and all 551 plus 31. And tied for fourth is Solarian124 and IR Daniel. So congratulations to all of you. Let's jump in, see what we can do. Okay, uh, we've got 11 points and partner opened a diamond. We've got a diamond fit. You could consider um, something like two diamonds if it was inverted, but you still want to check for your heart fit first anyway, typically, so we'll bid that. Hey, Zibson. Hey, David. Thanks for coming in. One spade, pass, pass. So I could consider something like three diamonds. Why is that only eight to 10? It should be stronger than that. I reckon eight to 10, I'd just bid two diamonds. Um, I could bid something like two spades, but they have that as game forcing. Seems strange. Um, I'm gonna bid three diamonds. I feel like it should be stronger. Partner might still occasionally bid. And partner didn't volunteer one no trump or anything, so I don't know where we would actually be going for the game. Five diamonds, a spade, two hearts. So partner's got 14, so three no here is just uh, cruisy. So that's a nuisance. Um, so we have uh, two club losers and two heart losers. Can draw trumps and just set up the spades to discard um, two things if they take it. And I can always just trump hearts. So we'll draw trumps. There, 2 2. Doubt this matters much because I suspect most people will be in 3 no trumps and there are really no demons in 3 no trumps. So. I'm just kind of shocked that three diamonds just isn't like invitational and two spades is also uh, game forcing. So anyway, I think three diamonds is the right bid. I think partner should bid three no trumps over it. Um, lose six imps or something. Only three imps. Hey, someone made the beer card. Nice. Briefly saw the uh, beer icon before the uh, chat disappeared. Yeah, congratulations, Sergeve. Um, all right. Okay, so only losing three imps, that's all right. Board number two. We've got 12 high card points. And a seven triple two. There are two hearts in front of me. Uh, I was vaguely considering do I open like a strong no trump or something pretty weird like that. Um, but uh, here it's just three diamonds. Maybe I could have considered something like uh, three hearts asking for a stop or something. Uh, do we ever have something like four no quantitative? Uh, it says 18 points. I, I clearly don't have 18 points, but what would I need? Let's give partner ace king of spades, ace of hearts. I would need something else. Uh, I'm still off the queen of diamonds though. I do think that like you could potentially make slam sometimes here, but. Ace King of Spades, Ace of Hearts. I can't have exactly uh, what I asked for. Um, and as I said, we need something a little bit more. Um, Ace is the person who preempted. Um, I want to duck a heart, but if they shift to a club, it's not so great. Um, but we'll, we'll do that. Okay, good. No, no. Uh, no club shift. Like if they managed to knock out the ace of clubs and the diamonds didn't come in, that would be real annoying.
Wow, the uh, Ramta had three diamonds. They continued hearts, then I like. It's not clear that you want to always choose to finesse. They've got what? They've got everything. Wow. Like it, it's a safety play to finesse, but whether or not uh, you actually go for it or not, it's an interesting choice. But uh, three no should be flat. Lost four imps. You'll take that. So we're positive. Uh, 12 points, pretty easy one diamonds. So here the question is, do I bid a spade? Let's say I bid a spade and then partner bids a no trump. I'd probably want to be in hearts and I could follow up with two hearts, but I would usually play that as like an invitational hand with like sort of 15 ish points. I'm actually just going to show a three card raise here. Well, show a four card raise with my three. Right. So partner's got an eight count. We have zero play on this. We're off the ace king of hearts, ace of diamonds, ace of clubs. I've led a spade, which looks like uh, the spade finesse is failing, but maybe I can sneak my diamond away anyway. All right. So the spade finesse works. Um, I could lead a diamond up. Can I get them to crash their honors ever? Maybe I just try and sneak a diamond to the uh, king or queen. Singleton king? No. All right, uh, so I played the seven of diamonds to the queen. Can I ever discard four clubs? Uh, that would be if, no, no, I can't. I can ditch one club on a diamond. Maybe I lead a club up here. Oh, okay, cool. So I'm just down one now. Uh, I can trump that. I don't think I can run into a trump promotion now. And we got the rest. So just down one. Yeah, minus three amps. So. If you do bid a spade, partner just repeats two hearts, which is quite nice that you get to stop in, in two hearts, yeah. I was really worried partner would bid a no trump, um, especially if I got like one fewer heart. And then I, I don't know how the robots would play a two heart bid after that. But, uh, jumping to four hearts is quite optimistic with this hand after I've opened their singleton now. King, queen, and diamonds, you switch that to the ace, and now we've suddenly got some play, so I could have easily had an extra trump and all that sort of stuff, but they were optimistic there, I think. Okay. So we've got 5-4 in the majors. We've got a 10 count, three card support for partner. Okay. Um, I could consider jumping to three diamonds. Why is this one a game forcing bid? How do I ever show invites? Like, I, I'm not usually one to like try and make that many invitational bids, but <laughs> my, the system is like, you cannot invite regardless. I guess they want me to bid two no trumps, but I'd prefer to play in diamonds if I had it. If partner's turning down the invite, I wanted to play in three diamonds rather than two no trumps. Right. Uh, club leads relatively friendly. Partner's got 14 high card points. We might have entry issues. Um, 
I really want them to take the uh, Ace of Diamonds. So, so they take it? No. Well, the Nine of um, Diamonds went. Our club's breaking. Can't discard too many spades here. Okay, clubs aren't breaking, but uh, them following with a diamond discard there is kind of useful. I think I can switch back to diamonds here. And we'll unblock our jack. It's our diamonds are all good. Okay. So at this stage, we've got four diamonds, four clubs, the ace of hearts. Um, I could potentially put in the jack of heart. They win, they play another heart. I, I'll put in the jack, but I really just don't see where I'd ever get an extra trick anyway. Yeah. Maybe... Uh, East is out of, maybe East is out of the hearts and they have the ace of spades and I can play a spade towards the king in the end. I really dislike that pop-up coming up all the time. Yeah, they have the Ace of Spades. They did not keep an old spade. Plus 11 imps. So they can hold up there. Um, so I think it was just, how do you induce them to take the Ace of Diamonds? So if you play like Jack of Diamonds Diamond, they get to see when people show out. Um, by leading, by hiding the Jack of Diamonds for a while and like playing the King Queen, you give them the chance that, well, maybe Diamonds were 2 2, maybe um, your, their partner has the Jack of Diamonds and that they should take it. And you just pose some problems to them. So that's all I was really trying to do. But uh, currently we're plus nine at the um, halfway mark I was showing like deal two and five yeah I was looking at the deal number there I was like have I really only played that many boards but the uh, pretty routine take out double here and partner just bit of no trump I'm not interested in game so we'll pass okay partner does have 10 points so we do have 24 lefty opened the bidding with one diamond um so East might have like two to four points, most likely. So a win there. And I think I wanted to start on clubs. I've got a two-way guess in spades of what I want to do. I don't have any great indications about which uh, way to do that, but uh, the clubs are all good. Okay. Now it does look like uh, West is a balanced hand because I've got three clubs, they opened a diamond. Um, I haven't seen any points from West yet. Keep discarding diamonds. I was wondering if I could do anything like lead a heart. Like West probably has a heart on her. Like I could very safely just... Um, take my two spades and be done with it. But I feel like I'll get my, my spades anyway. And they might open up spades if I laid hearts. West wins their ace. Okay, so uh, the, I said they had two to four points. So East has the uh, queen. I can duck that. Get the hearts. 
Uh, they, I think they've discarded enough diamonds. That might be their last. They might have one more. So I think if I had just played East for the Queen of Spades, I could have got more tricks. It might have even been a doubleton queen. Yeah, so you have to be slightly careful here with the doubleton queen because the entries are a bit messed up, but I think I could have got one more. But that should be okay anyway. Okay, plus one imp, some people got plus two. Yeah, so if I just start with spades, I can get the extra trick. Okay, 11 high card points were favorable, so I'm definitely going to open this and just read a bit of no trump. And three no it is. Okay, number six. Board six, a few to go. Uh, We've got 15, four, triple, three. They're leading the suit that we bid, which is peculiar. We've got two diamonds, a spade, and a club four. And I can build tricks in every suit bar diamonds. Let's start by uh, taking a finesse. The 10. So they led the five. We're missing the four and the two. They could have a six card suit. Um, Let's start with heart, because heart always need to be played from the north hand. It's a bit a touch iffy playing on hearts, because looking at the dummy, that might have been a suit that they would want to, to target. Um, but. Okay. Uh, I think I'm just playing a club to the nine, but I probably shouldn't. Okay, so I can play a club over to the nine and a heart up now. If they ducked the heart before, it's really bad. You could also play like a spade to the jack. Are they ever not putting, like, I feel like they would always put the king of spades on there with how good the spades are. So I think the spade finesse is working. Okay, I can always now overtake the club because of that club discard, so that's fine. Um, so now I can also play a heart. My, the Jack Tenor hearts are gone. I haven't seen the eight of hearts, but uh, we'll, there's the eight. My seven's now a winner. So they get the ace and we have the rest. So I got the ace of spades, the ace of diamonds for these two. Club over to my hand and they're all good. That was a very, very friendly layout. Okay, plus five imps. Okay. Second last board. We've got a 12 count, so one spade, probably one spade, two spades sort of stuff. Who know? Uh, game force, there's just Jacoby. Um, so what they do is all those new suits are shortages. Uh, three spades shows a lot of extras. Three no shows 15 to 17. See, um, I kind of, like, my, my bid's bidding four spades, but having the sixth spade, having like uh, king, like those kings, if partners, I don't want to discourage partner that much. If they have like ace, 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 I guess they need four aces and something else. So maybe it's a touch, but okay. I'm happy now. So we've got, I played zero, three, one, four. So five diamonds shows one or four. Do I have the uh, queen? And I do. So I also want to show... Uh, where I have kings as well. So here this says I've got the queen of spades and I've got the king of clubs. So here we are. Uh, 
All right, so we're off the Ace of Spades, um, but outside of that, we're all good, assuming we don't get trumped anywhere. So um, we'll just lay the spade up. <laughs> that <laughs> that feels lucky. <laughs> uh, that the person who had the singleton spade was the person who also had the singleton. Like when the, they showed out in I was like, oh, well, that's not good. But yeah, two spades there. Wow, Sing two, dual singletons plus three imps. How did it, like, did they open a week two in spades? Yeah, it looks like they showed a week two. I feel like your hand's pretty good. I wanted to be encouraging there. So the fact that partner took control, that's awesome. So uh, final board. 15 high card points, four triple three, but trip aces and a king, that's all decent. Two clubs here is mages. And they're in two hearts. Okay. Eight of clubs lead. So uh, we're not really progressing further in clubs. I want to try and see if they've got a guess in diamond. So I'll just lead a low diamond, see if we can get out diamond tricks before they disappear um, on the clubs. Jack of spades ducked. I was vaguely keen, keen to uh, draw some trumps at some stage, uh, but it looks like um, partner wasn't up for that. Um, so that little hat, they'll be able to trump one thing and they can probably throw something else on the jacket clubs. My partner actually had two spades. I could have just cashed my king. I, they could have potentially thrown this two spades away on the clubs. It was a bit fortunate there. Partner has a good hand. I'm actually surprised that they didn't balance here um, or like try and compete to three of a minor. They've got five, five in the minors. So how might they do that? They One no trump, pass, pass, fine. Two clubs, two hearts. If they did two no there, I feel like that should have been for the minors. And that's what I would have uh, tried with their hand. But we actually got plus three imps there for beating two hearts. But yeah, we can make uh, four clubs or four, four diamonds. All right, finished with plus 21, uh, which is all pretty good. Um, I lost three imps on... These deals are all out of order. Uh, this board one where I had the wanted to show an invite. The fact that I couldn't show that was just irritating for me. And uh, outside of that, uh, I was pretty happy with all that. So I don't think I actually did anything particularly interesting, but yeah. Down three clubs after downgrading this rubbish to one club, which partner preemptively raised. However, it's hard to believe that North could not compete over two hearts in auctions, but South opened one no trump. I wholeheartedly agree. But yeah, anyway, uh, thanks for watching uh, this week's Fun Bridge tournament. I uh, hope you enjoy it, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.